Hey guys, Germán here from Visaya. I'm here in the center of Berlin to understand what's valuable. A car, a fancy hotel that is one behind me. What about love? Of course I love you guys, but I will only marry once. And when I do, I will give my fiance something precious. A ring, a ring made of silver, gold. What about platinum? Platinum is one of the most expensive metals in the world. Today, you can get one kilogram of platinum for around 27,000 euros. But why is so damn expensive? First of all, it's one of the rarer elements on Earth. 80% of this metal is found in South Africa. And you need to process one ton of rock mineral to get between five to seven grams of platinum. But what really makes this element shine are its properties. Platinum is highly malleable and ductile. This makes it perfect to make jewelry. It does not react with oxygen, so it will keep its silver white color for eternity. It's actually so stable that the standard prototypes for kilogram and meter are made for platinum iridium bars. Platinum has one property that makes it even cooler. Platinum is used as a catalyst, used in petrochemical and chemical industries in various processes. For example, is it using catalytic reforming that transforms straight drawn naphtas into higher octane gasoline. Gasoline that then is used in cars, where platinum has again a crucial role. It's used in catalytic converters in cars in order to break down some of the most harmful byproducts of the automobile exhaust. Today, more than 50% of platinum produced per year is used for catalytic purposes. But this is a really rare metal, so potentially we could have a limit of how many cars we will be able to produce. And even if not everyone believes in climate change, we still need to keep the rising temperatures in check. Talking about temperature, platinum is used in one of the most common industrial temperature sensors, the RTD. A thin layer of platinum is deposited in a ceramic substrate. In order to create a resistor, the PT100 is the most common RTD used in the industry. The resistance varies with temperature changes. This variation then can be measured and translated into a temperature value using a temperature transmitter. If you want to learn more about temperature transmitters, check the video below. Above 600 degrees Celsius, RTDs hit a limit and thermocouples are used for industrial temperature measurement. And guess what? Here, platinum again is used for applications that exceed more than 1,100 degrees Celsius, thanks to its high melting point and thermal stability. Platinum thermocouples are used in high temperature applications like furnaces, glass, and metal production. So it seems we finished this video where we started. Platinum is one of the most valuable elements used in processes, instruments, and as a symbol of love enhanced everywhere. If you love this video, remember to subscribe. Thank you for watching, till next time.